Here we are in Manhattan at the Javits Center for the new, this year's Food and Restaurant Expo. Wait till you see what we eat. They give away everything here. It's a lot of fun. This is my third year in a row. I'm with Kathy and I'm with Mark. Watch what we eat. Are you good? It's kind of like our so tell us about your bourbon. Okay, so we are Taconic Distillery. We make New York bourbon and rye whiskeys. What makes it different? It's um, made in New York. It's delicious. We grow all our grains in New York. The spring water is from our farm. We're located 80 miles north of New York City in so Dutchess no County. Blades in this. No, it's oh. safe. I, I'll even take a sip of it well, to, make, to prove that it's it. safe for give, you. Give me okay. a sip. I'm going to give you our straight bourbon whiskey, which is 90 proof. This is 90 proof? Yes. Okay. So here I am at Javits, New York brewed bourbon. Oh, is that smooth? That is really smooth. I've had soda that had more of a bite. This is really good. All right, my work here is done. Thank you. Okay, this is Catskill Provisions uh, rye whiskey infused with their own honey. Mmm, absolutely delicious. Very enjoyable. So we have um, honey, honey infused products. Restaurant line right over there. You can try some of those. You heard her? She called me honey. I heard that. We hear that you have you have an inner queen bee. Can we see that? Yeah. Well, well, follow me over here. Channel your inner queen bee. Stand here. Queen bee. Are you taking the I am right now. That's the buzz. I'm with the queen bee. I'm having a shot. This is my fourth shot. I can still feel my feet. About the honey, honey. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, about... Who's talking? Oh me. All right, what's your name? Stephanie. Stephanie. Yes. And do you make the honey? So we have we have an apiary up state. We have 250 beehives. Um, we do a spring and fall wildflower honey. So we harvest the honey twice a year, so we don't take all the honey away from the bees um, at one point. And it also gives us two different varietals. So the spring's a little more lighter, more fruity, some pear and apple trees. And then the fall is uh, a little richer, has a higher sugar content. Um, it's going to be some goldenrod and some sunflower. So you get subtle differences, but what great with different taste? cheeses. We're going to taste both of them. We're going to bring right, you to both of them. Okay, so I got myself some honey here. I'm going to give it a big taste. Yep. I'm going to mm. grab some. I would love to try Oh, that's some. very good. Let me, get, let me get my camera And out. they mix this in their scotch. Yes. That's really good. <laughs> I thought you were getting a video. Oh, or a okay. photo. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Here we go. There you go. And then here's the ketchup. Here's the okay, ketchup. Okay, so uh, oh, this is my second hit. Yes. Yeah, fall wildflower honey. honey, right? Yes, exactly. Wildflower honey. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's really sweet. A little different. Who gave you a speaking part? So these are truffles. Yep. And what's in them? These are just sweetened with a little bit of our fall wildflower honey as well. And, uh, and, and Kathy's going to try one. Ooh, truffles. Chocolate and honey. You can't go wrong. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, God. You want these? Uh-oh. You want these? So they gave me all these truffles. I'm going to try one. Nobody knows the truffles, you see? Oh my God. <laughs> well, I'll see ya. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting some tapioca. It's only been sitting here for eight weeks. No! Uh, <laughs> the food show and I got me some tapioca from Real Fresh. Let's see what this is all about. No! Yeah, I'm only kidding. It's delicious. Oh yeah. That's slowly becoming my favorite. Oh, this is very good. It's a yeast raised dough. It's a three and a half ounce uh, portion in a five and a half ounce cup. We take the dough out of the cup and dip it in pearl sugar right before baking. 
we fold the pearl sugar manually completely into the dough and then this whole ball of dough and sugar goes into the waffle iron you lock it up uh, the moisture cannot escape the moisture becomes steam start shaving away on those chunks of sugar they stay in there the chunks of sugar you can see the well, they stay in there, but they become noticeably smaller. And uh, when that sweet steam comes out of the dough and hits the iron, it immediately caramelizes and puts a glaze of caramelized sugar on the outside of your waffle. And then you add more sugar. I don't have that. Uh, why not? <laughs> Tell me a little bit about crunch roll. Crunch roll is a frozen appetizer snack item. This one here is your banana pepper crunch roll. Four cheeses. Hungarian banana peppers, garlic, spices, wrapped in a crispy, crunchy shell. I'm going to taste the crunch roll here at Javits. Very good. Winner. Very different. Unique? Seems to be staying down. Always a good sign. Making you a Dimitri's Bloody Mary. This is the original recipe, garnished with a Blazes Bean, which is my product I've been doing for 25 years. You've been making Bloody Marys for 25 years. And pickling beans for longer. There you go, sir. That's my Bloody Mary. That's your Bloody Mary. So I got this Bloody Mary. You see what I've been eating and drinking all day? Maybe I'll be able to walk. Well, that's very good. You got the job. What's your name? I'm Tom Fisher. Uh, and what do you do? I'm the founder of bourbonbelong.com and the creator of the first ever whiskey sommelier program, which is what that is. It's solid chocolate. It is, yeah. <laughs> no, it's a pretty serious piece of jewelry, and uh, we're the first ever sommelier program for whiskey in the world. Uh, we teach it in Texas. We'll soon be teaching it elsewhere. But I'm on the road a lot teaching about whiskey in a program called Why Whiskey, which is what I'm doing here at the uh, at the expo at the show I've been to all these from LA to Orlando I'm glad to be here in New York we're on some Hudson some Jefferson's Whistlepig Breckenridge the new RBK very very rare there's only three bottles this in the country um, and um, let me try one well, Tom Fisher, the Y Whiskeys, put me on to Hudson Baby Bourbon Whiskey. Excellent. We're going to try it. I've seen it out. Lovely. You want this and you don't want to rush it.